Mississippi State College of Veterinary Medicine has a lot of programs that are nationally known and our population medicine program is one of those. We're very proud of our residency, which is a three-year residency for veterinarians and it is one of three approved residencies in the United States through the American College of Veterinary Preventive Medicine. We're one of the very few schools that has a population medicine program and so I'm very proud of that because I think our students leave here with a whole new way to think about what they're doing and how it affects the other animals and how it affects the environment. And I think they leave here better clinicians because they know how to make very good clinical decisions based on science and evidence. We have uh, really good uh, immunologists, people that are working on um, infectious diseases and the host response to, to uh, those diseases. We have the largest number of epidemiologists uh, of any of the colleges of veterinary medicine in the United States. Another area that we're known for in the college is our work with antimicrobial stewardship. When we develop resistance because we're using antimicrobials, that means bacterial infections are difficult to treat. Addressing the stewardship helps keep those antimicrobials available to us for both people and animals and as well as plants. Thanks to all the resources we have here at Mississippi State University, we've been able to do work that has gotten national attention. My students present work at meetings in the United States. Several of my students presented work at meetings in Spain last year. We are very fortunate to have the support that has led to a program that certainly has gotten national attention and even international attention for our work in trying to help keep cattle healthy. We have experts in pathology, microbiology, virology, parasitology, immunology, toxicology, and so what's amazing about this collection of expertise is that it, it offers that opportunity for our students to engage in all those different disciplines and because of this unique collection of expertise that's also one of the things that made us attractive to the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization and one of the reasons why they recognize the Mississippi State College of Veterinary Medicine as one of only four FAO reference centers for antimicrobial resistance and aquaculture biosecurity globally and the only one in the United States. I never dreamed I would be able to manage a program that is addressing food security and helping children in developing countries. I didn't know I could have such a direct impact. Working at Mississippi State College of Veterinary Medicine has allowed me to be engaged in several nationally recognized programs that I wouldn't be able to be engaged in working elsewhere. We really have uh, premier programs across so many different areas in veterinary medicine. You want to come here to be a well-rounded veterinarian, but if you have an interest in some sort of specialty, we're probably a leader in that specialty. So I picked Mississippi State because I love aquatics and they're only one of two veterinary schools in the nation that actually have a marine mammal program, which is very unique and not something you can find everywhere. So I feel very lucky to be here and be able to follow my passion at Mississippi State. We are part of the Gulf Coast Aquatic Health Lab. I educate all College of Veterinary Medical students working with marine mammals as well as sea turtles. And I think the students are very enthusiastic about it because you don't get an opportunity very often to work with dolphins and, and, and sea turtles. So these students are actually getting hands-on work with the most critically endangered sea turtle in the world. So they're able to see them, work with them, follow through medically, and then actually physically take them back out and release them back out into the Mississippi Sound, which is exciting for all students. Our shelter medicine program is nationally recognized. In fact, students come from all over the country because of that program. Shelter medicine is a specialty in veterinary medicine. And it is providing both individual animal care to dogs and cats or other species that are brought into shelters or picked up by animal control and brought to shelters. But it's also herd health. It's how do you manage the health of a population of animals, unrelated animals that have been brought into a shelter. Our students, they get this extensive experience across the board in all the aspects of animal management in the shelter, animal care in the shelter, but especially they get this Im immense surgical experience. On average, typically during your third or fourth year, you do pretty much like 50 to 60 surgeries at least minimum. So you get your hands-on experience. I know a lot of clinicians and a lot of um, clinics when you want to work, they value that so much because they notice you've gotten experience to do that. So I've been 
very grateful for the opportunity. We think it's incredibly important and we value the volume of surgeries that we get to provide our students. They are day one ready upon graduation and knowing that they're graduating with a degree that will take them far starting in day one is such an important value for us.